Happy Anthisteria 2021. So today I'm going to show you guys how I honor Dionysus. Today is a celebration of life and it's a celebration of the coming of spring. So Anthisteria is a three-day event, but I'll show you guys just the first day since this is my last day off before I have to go back to work. So today we are going to honor Dionysus, uh, present some flowers and drink some wine and offer prayers and incense to the God who sets us free. And we're going to remember life. As spring comes, we're going to remember what it is to live. So I'm going to have a drink or two later today, not in this video this time. And we're going to pray and celebrate Dionysos or Dionysus in Anthisteria. Hope you guys like this video and enjoy. Alright guys, so you're in my kitchen, so I figured for this holiday I'd actually show you how I prep and get ready for my prayers to Dionysos or Dionysus. So, for the day, for this holiday, you're supposed to offer flowers to represent the coming spring. So, these are two, I do believe, carnations that I am using as an offering. And also, these are, I think these are lilies, but they're dried lilies that I have. But you'll notice that they have a purple tint to them. So I noticed that, so instead of throwing them away, I'm going to reuse them as offerings to Dionysus because of the purple and red tints that remind me of the wine. If I can grab this one, I'll show you this. So I don't know, you'll see that it has a natural purple tint to it. And my crazy cat, <laughs> she's already celebrating the hysteria of Dionysus. She's running around like crazy. When you hear scratching, that's what all that is. So that's it. And if you want to know what wine I use, let's see, let's get this. The wine that I use is offering a Dionysus or Dionysus. I always like to use Apothic Dark red wine. This is the stuff. I love this stuff. And I will offer him pure wine but in tradition of Dionysus, as he taught, you dil you dilute the wine by making it three parts water and one part wine. And that's going to go into here. And that's actually what I'm going to partake of. But before we do that, I'm going to use Kernips to cleanse myself before ritual. So this is just sea salt. I'm going to put tap water on it and then light a bay leaf, drop it in. And that's what makes Kernips to purify myself in the altar before ritual. All right, the wine be open. So like I've mentioned, I'm going to now um, dilute it into my ritual bottle. And then during ritual, I'll actually give pure wine to Dionysus. It's a little early to drink. It's only 9.30 in the morning, but luckily we're diluting it, so I'm not gonna get that cambered. But it's all in honor of Dionysus, Apothic Dark. All right, so I have my currants right here. All I'm going to do now is say a prayer and then light this bay leaf and drop it in here. Blessings you, great gods, and I thank you, great Apollon, the great purifying God, and great Poseidon, the God of the sea. I thank you that you purify this water for blessing and that I may honor the gods. Hail to you, great ones, as I purify this water and purify myself in honor of you and the altar for ritual. Hail and blessings to you, great gods. And it is done. First prayer is always to Goddess Hestia, the goddess of the home and hearth. Thank you, great goddess, for home and family, and I give you the honor, as always, of first prayers. Hail and blessings to you, great watcher of Olympus, Keeper of the sacred flame of Apollon. Hell and blessings to you, God Goddess Hestia. Hell and blessings. I thank on and honor you today, great God, great Dionysos, the one who frees and liberates us from all bonds. 
Hell and blessings to you on this day as we honor the coming of spring and the coming of flowers and life. Hell and blessings to you and I give you incense today, great God of liberation, great God of freedom. Let us be free as I honor you today. I say hell again to you, great liberator, the one who sets us free. I thank you, great God. Thank you for being with us and setting us and letting us see our, letting us see our true selves. The God of the arts, the God of theater, the reflection of man, I thank you. A gift of flowers for you. May they honor you, great one. Hell and blessings to you for all in life that you give. Hail to you, great God. Hail and blessings to you, great Dionysus. Thank you for hearing me. Thank you for being with me and setting us free. Hail and blessings to you, great one. I open to you the bottle and share with you the new wine. Hail and blessings to you, great one. To your goblet I give, hail in you. And as you have taught, I will share with you with mixed wine. Hail, and I drink to you, great Dionysus, great freedom, great liberator. I thank you. I invoke Dionysus, the roaring god of the Bacchanal, first made, double-natured and thrice-born, the Bacchic lord, wild, ineffable, hidden and two-horned, two-formed and teeming with ivy, bull-faced like Ares, crying evoe, holy and savage. You hold triennial feasts where you are clothed in ivy, bearing clusters of grapes. Clever Eubulius, you were born from Zeus and Persephone, when he lay with her in her bed, which is not spoken. Immortal demon, sweet and blameless, hear my voice, and with a kind heart, inspire us, together with your finely dressed nurses. <laughs> 